This month, the Bureau of Labor Statistics released their estimates for employment changes in Maryland for November 2020. During this period, Maryland gained a total of 24,100 jobs. Between October and November, the state's unemployment rate decreased to 6.8%. In the past month, COVID-19 has continued to spread across the United States, with nearly every state experiencing a record high in newly reported cases in the weeks following the Thanksgiving holiday. In Maryland, this has led to the shutdown of indoor dining in Baltimore City, Prince George's County, Anne Arundel County, and Montgomery County. Baltimore City has also taken the step of shutting down all outdoor dining. With Congress looking to settle on a reduced stimulus package, these shutdowns will not be accompanied by the same level of economic relief seen during the original lockdown in the spring. The surge also threatens many retailers that rely on the holiday season as their most profitable time of the year. While many stores remain open at reduced capacity, many shoppers are choosing to complete their shopping online to minimize their risk of exposure. In more positive news, the last month has brought significant progress on the approval and distribution of the first coronavirus vaccines. Maryland began to administer the first vaccines this week in hopes to fully vaccinate more than 150,000 state residents who are critical healthcare workers, live or work in long-term care facilities, or are first responders by the end of the year. Although widespread vaccinations will not be available to the public until at least the late spring or summer, this represents an important step towards the end of the pandemic. Once the vaccine is administered to enough Marylanders, it will be safer to lift business restrictions and allow the state to enter a full economic recovery. RESI will continue to keep an eye on this and other stories related to the coronavirus pandemic as they develop. Follow the link below for a deeper dive into this month's employment numbers and visit www.towson.edu slash RESI to learn more about our services.